Now back to your regularly scheduled Octo Valley. Oh, that's this island. So which island is... Ah, uh, yes, it's this one. I can give you my solemn promise that I do not throw things on purpose. Unless it's for, like, experimental purposes. To be like, okay, I'm gonna mess this up, but I want to see if. <laughs> Alright, I've done... I guess I can upgrade my Seekers to level 3 with the eggs I got from Amiibo. <laughs> Not that I think I'll end up using them in this fight, but hey. Let's see the original. Oh, wait. Before we see the original ending. There's one more thing that I must show. I'm going to flip through the sunken scrolls. And some of you are probably already aware of this little Easter egg. But just in case. Gotta be thorough. And at least show that I'm aware it exists. Keep your eye on the bottom right corner of the page. Ready? Go. Okay, it looks like it's missing one frame at the end, but there it is in reverse. Like flip note before flip note. Well, after flip note. During flip note. I don't know my timetable for 3DS. <laughs> I love when stream delay makes that happen. <laughs> There's the giant fish. Stay back, Agent 3. It's a trap. Figures. Well, we don't have a choice. Well, we have a choice. I could just jump off this ledge right now. All right. The original Splatoon final boss. Take it away. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna remix your face. All right, starting out. Watch out for the missiles, and then, of course, shoot the hands. <laughs> Whee! And that's three hits. That means it's over, right? Because that's how Nintendo bosses work. <laughs> Y'all ready for this? And here comes the giant missile. Hey, it's also a Phantom Ganon boss. <laughs> it's a Nintendo hands boss and a Nintendo tennis boss. <laughs>
All right, now he brings out the killer whale as well as the propeller platforms, but He'll be blocking you for a bit, so don't take the propeller platform just yet Now we gotta double fist him I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Here's the sunken scroll for this boss. <laughs> it does not show up at the end like all the other bosses. You have to pick it up from that box during the fight. It's still pretty early in the fight, so it's not too hard to pick up. But I could see someone missing it just because, again, none of the other bosses work that way. <laughs> Yeah, you ain't your killer whale up. Beat this. Can't handle my spicy wasabi beats. Okay. I'm not sure what SFX is. Or what the wrench from that was. Yeah. Dang, Zuka, where? So now he's firing regular enemies at us, too. Oh, there's the Ink Zuka. Let's not let sponges be the death of me again. You're about to get mashed up. I'll just draw your fire over here. And I didn't get to hit that missile, though. Stand in the epicenter of the killer whale, that would be great. Do you know who you're messing with? Yep, this one's still going. Look, an invisible floor over there. Oh, 
Definitely keep you loaded up on armor if you want it. Another ring, Zuka. I haven't used the first one. like a little bit of a waste, but, uh... Funny how the, in the invisible platforms only return for this boss fight after they're introduced. They weren't used anywhere else in between. Even though there were stages that iterated on previous gimmicks. Man. Time to, to drop the sea base. Bass. Oh god, that hit me. <laughs> I thought the Inkzuka would last a bit longer. Oh god! This balloon might be helpful. Hit those, they'll stop the enemies from coming. Did that not hit the missile? I thought the balloon hit the missile. Maybe if I draw the fire up here. Or if I just wait up here, he'll shoot over me. That works too. Here we do, we do. Do 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 Okay, got it. What's this? Where's my beats? Not roll. Are you all not? Radio override activated. Huh? That heavenly melody. It's the one and only Squid Sisters. Don't you ever worry your granddaughters like that again. Agent 3, take care of Gramps for us, okay? Final push, charge. Final checkpoint. Back everything. Oh god. And number one. And number two. Kind of think of it, how does a burst bomb deal with this stuff? It breaks those, which makes sense. Yeah, it doesn't really help much against the hands.
Maybe don't want to be that close right now. Now, when I first played this game, keep in mind Splatoon was like my first shooter ever. So getting to this point in the game originally it was nuts. And there was so much to contend with for someone new. And now it's almost cute, even though there's still a bit of a challenge to it. Like, <laughs> I'm not gonna go as far as to call it a cakewalk. You know, I think I'm missing the part where I shoot the hands from here and he gets knocked back further. I think that's how they're trying to keep you in check. Thank you, Corner, for not being hit by the killer whale. And now I can join you up here. Bubbler. You go back. You go back. Now he's up here. Very little space. Especially with the killer whale as wide as it is. You ready to turn quick? And don't forget about the giant missile that's about to cut him down. Oh shoot. Well that was a waste of a bubbler. God, that last one comes so fast. Are you gonna fire the missile? Did not count. Oh my god. No, I don't think there's a dub stop thing. Oh my god. Now finish him. Oh no, so sad. Or should I say, pass us on the Cobalt the Puff Rock.
They could have, but they wanted to make it a gauntlet. Do you get it? Gauntlet? <laughs> I just thought of that. Why am I French? Oh, because I was reading the upside down text. You know, I actually am part French, right? Like 50% so. Okay, it's late, but we've got a midnight news flash. Wait, what's going on? What time is it? The great Zapfish is back on Inkopolis Tower. Whoa, for serious? That's a shocker. Where was it anyway? I guess we'll never know. Well, hey, at least it's back now. Yeah, let's rock. At this hour? Eh, why not? Right, it's time. You know, they say right stick air, but the left stick still works for aiming. And the squeegee's trying to obscure the names of the directors. Uh, of course, this was pretty fun to uh, have. Uh, you can use the burst bombs with the R button. Again, mix and match the colors. Because the burst bomb will always be a different color from the splatter shot. So many names that brought this little creative work to life. It's Splatoon was like the first new franchise for Nintendo in a while when, when it came out. And it was definitely a needed breath of fresh air for their IP. But it came out on the Wii U. <laughs> and so they made a sequel. Hey, don't we know I'm I'm known for my racing content as, as long as that racing content involves Labo. <laughs> do 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 do. Oh, we're up to the special thanks already. Yeah, you better thank NOE Quality Assurance and Monolith Software Incorporated. Very special thanks to Monolith Software Incorporated. Yes, yes. I thought Arms was a decent new fighter, but unfortunately they didn't really follow up with it. And I know it wasn't the biggest success in the world, but it wasn't terribly un- like, it, it wasn't totally unsuccessful. Hey, you can keep shooting the thanks for playing screen as much as you want. You can make it purple, or pink, or blue. Some little combination. Yeah, that looks pretty good to me. Look at these suits you can use in online multiplayer. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> sure, yep, that is a thing that you can do on the Wii U. Uh-huh. So guess what the final amiibo challenges are? <laughs> <laughs> 